It's a bright morning. Welcome to the AM News here on the AM Show. My name is Pakwe Si Shandov. To a very first story, Minister for Food and Agriculture, Dr. Ifriye Akoto, has set up an interministerial committee to prevent the smuggling of grains from the country. This follows a joint news investigative piece on the smuggling of soybeans to Togo at Triponi by Guinean farmers. According to the minister, the committee drawn from national security, trade and industry and the local government ministries will ensure strict measures are followed to prevent the activities of smugglers. Now, with these reports, and we had heard other reports before, the government of Ghana has set up an interministerial committee of which I'm the chairman, made up of the Ministry of Interior, uh, Defense, uh, uh, local government, trade and industry, and, and the rest, and the Ministry of Finance, Customs, and so on, to ensure that these directives are implemented. And by the way, it's not only Ghana. All the West African countries have put a ban. Nigeria, you can't, there's a, a law, a very strict law, saying that you can't, if a foreigner, go to a farm gate to buy any produce. And so it's, it's just in response to what is happening. This committee, I've met this interministerial committee. We've set up a technical committee. And the reason why we are bringing in the local government ministry is because of the district assemblies. You have to comply. The Ministry of National Security is also involved. So hence, we are going to be very, very strict and not sit at the borders to, to police the borders, but to go to specific markets where these things they come to buy to ensure that they are prevented from buying. So uh, we are going to see very strict adherence to this new uh, policy of banning, especially now that with God uh, permitting, we've had very good rains. The harvest, the new maize is already on the market. Prices are beginning to, 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 to slide seasonally as we expect it to do. As more harvest comes in, prices uh, always go, 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 go down. So we are taking these measures in anticipation that the coming harvest will stay in Ghana, not only to feed our people, but also to, to support the poultry industry to survive and to, and to thrive. So these are the measures that we are taking to implement the policy.